Welcome to our Wednesday afternoon song circle. It's so nice to be with you uh, today. Hope you're doing well and enjoying the nice warm weather. So uh, let's get started. Let's uh, let's sing some songs. Let's get into some music. So uh, today I kind of focused on three artists that I um, um, uh, that I'm really inspired by and love to share their music for. Um, so. We're going to focus on music from Rabbi Josh Warshawski, Rabbi Yosef Goldman, and uh, Joe Buchanan as well. And so I've uh, picked several selections from each of them. Um, but first, we'll start off with uh, um, a little nigun that I wrote on the Oud this summer. Just a nice way to kind of get in the groove. And I was feeling uh, that I needed a, you know, get my oud chops up. So why not have a little oud song to kind of warm us up and get us into that groove for today. So this is, uh, I don't actually have a name for this thing quite yet, but we'll see how it goes. So maybe take this moment to just come into the space. Let go of whatever you're working on for a moment. Let go of things that may have been bothering you today. And then let's come into this melody. Let the melody deepen our, our state of mind and our connection to ourselves and to the divine. Thank you. 
back to the oud a little bit later uh, when we play another one uh, a, a tune by uh, Rabbi Yosef Goldman but until then I would like to teach a new one for us <sighs> this next one is called Hamera and it is by um, Rabbi Josh Warshawski and uh, Colleen, uh, Colleen uh, Diker uh, she's actually a wonderful violinist and musician um, that I actually got to record with uh, many years ago. I met her at Song Leader Boot Camp, and um, she's uh, just incredible and such an honor to have worked with her. But her, uh, her and Josh Roshowski came up with this melody, and Hamera is part of our weekday and Shabbat morning liturgy. Um, so it starts off with a uh, nigun, and so we'll just start there. And uh, I'll go a little slow so that we can learn this together. Um, Hamera, Hamera la Aretz, the Ladarim, Aleha, Berachamim. And those are the next words for this next part. It goes like this Hamera, Hamera, Hamera. Part of that first uh, of, of that first part of the words is a little different. Again, Hamera. Beautiful. So there's that little repeat after me kind of part there, and then part C, the third part here.
No, I can't remember exactly when he released it. Oh, uh, I, I think maybe like in 2018 or so. Um, so awesome. Let's keep it going. Let's sing another Josh Ruschowski. This is another one that's normally part of our uh, morning liturgy and not actually commonly in our reform uh, morning liturgy, uh, but a beautiful song nonetheless. It's uh, from Psalm uh, 59 and it's Va'ani Ashir Uzecha. And what we're saying is, um, but I will sing of your strength, extol each morning your loving kindness, for you have been my haven and my refuge in time of trouble. To you, oh my strength, I will sing. Just a really, really beautiful few lines from this, uh, from this amazing psalm of King David. And uh, has a really, this song, um, and this melody that uh, Rabbi Josh Roshowski wrote, is just incredible and has kind of that sleely, that spiral nigun effect that we get sometimes from uh, uh, from nigunim and from uh, our, our um, liturgical music. All right, so this is Va'ani Yeshu Zecha. over and over again uzi elecha azamera azamera like this
beautiful song, a beautiful melody, uh, Josh Roshowski, and of course, Psalm uh, 59. Cool, let's keep going. I'm kind of liking this little thing that we got. Now we're going to switch up the artists. Okay, we just did a couple Josh Roshowskis. Now we're going to do a couple Joe Buchanan. So let's sing his Hine Matov, um, also known as uh, How Good It Is. Um, really awesome melody. I think uh, it sounds like by the by the, uh, in the English of these lyrics that he put to uh, um, to the melody of uh, or to the words of Hine Matov, uh, he might be kind of reminiscing on um, when the Jews received the Ten Commandments uh, uh, from uh, from God from on Mount Sinai and maybe uh, is speaking of that wondrous, that amazing feeling of, first of all, being in awe in the presence of God, but also together, having that moment, a, a collective moment with the rest of the Jewish people, and how important that is that uh, to our tradition to stick together and to be within, uh, um, um, to, to be a kahila kadosha, to be a, um, a great big community. So here is... Um, Joe Buchanan's How Good It Is. Well, I remember when I was there on that mountain a hey, long ago. I'm going to go up a half step, actually. Let me just go just a little bit higher for us on that one. Well, I remember when I was there on that mountain a hey, long ago. I've been told that you were there with me, brothers and sisters, now were we all? Well, I remember there was thunder on that mountain from the Lord. We carry in us all the memories of those. certainly isn't that right how good it is that we're all together that we're spending uh this time uh yes absolutely let's do some hashivenu uh i'm gonna sing one more from joe buchanan and actually we'll do that before we transition to doing a couple joseph goldman tunes sound good awesome. perfect perfect okay cool let's uh let's sing a little uh shalom alechem by joe buchanan um Really awesome melody. I like kind of what he did with this. It has that Americana kind of bluegrass country kind of vibe to it. <laughs> Colin 
calling in the angels, calling in that peace, calling in that goodness for all of us and all the people around us. May those angels help guide us. Shalom Aleichem, Malachi Shalom, Malachi you enjoyed that as well. Little Joe Buchanan, Hinim, uh, Hinim Atov, Shalom Aleichem, uh, one of the many great melodies that this guy has. All right, so let's keep going. Let's sing a little Hashi Venu Havaya. And this uh, this melody is a melody that uh, uh, Yoel Sykes came up with and I helped him produce it and turn it into a nice big track we had. Another friend of mine, sing on it. She's a student rabbi at Judaism Your Way, a really great friend. I've known her since branch camp back in the day. Hashi Benu, repeat after me. Hashi Benu Havaya. Yes, Hadesh Yamin, Hadesh Yamin, 
with those words, we uh, were saying, let's open that way. Let's open the way to God. So we're always connected and we're always returning to uh, that connection of the divine. It's so easy for us to get lost in our day-to-day -day lives and our stresses and our things that bother us and the people that said something that maybe rubbed you wrong. Uh, but it's important for us to take a moment at least every day to reconnect, to, re, uh, to reestablish yourself, to rejuvenate and uh, to return uh, to, to goodness, return to the divine and return to yourself. Awesome. Let's switch it up. Let's sing a little in ode Milbado. There is nothing else but the divine. There's nothing else but God. Just like that piece of artwork right up there, right above me by uh, Avram, a, a wonderful painter in, um, in Spot. And actually uh, the brother-in-law of one of my best friends, actually. <laughs> so a small Jewish world. Um, I remember telling him about him one day and he's like, oh, wait, Avram, like the guy in spot that he does his spiel with a lot of the trips up there and you get to learn a little bit about your Jewish name and a little bit about Kabbalah. I was like, yeah, that's him. He's like, yep, yep, that's my brother-in-law. He married my sister. <laughs> so so yeah, small Jewish world, which is just amazing. So uh, this one, Ein Od Mil Bado. Um, yeah, beautiful, beautiful melody and um, touching in with uh, kind of those Sephardic uh, Mizrahi roots that I know uh, Rabbi Yosef Goldman um, is connected to. You can hear a lot of those kind of elements in his um, uh, in his uh, album, uh, Open the Heart or Open Your Heart. All right, so here we go. Ain't on mill the
wonderful melody by Rabbi Yosef Goldman. One of my favorites, I think, on the album. Uh, but let's go to one of my other favorites, too. Uh, let's, let's sing now his version of Eliyahu Hanavi. Kind of has a nice uh, calypso, almost Latin-y style beat. Kind of, kind of has a little bit of a Latin jazz vibe to it, um, which I personally like uh, a, a little bit more than that than the traditional droning one. Which, of course, we gotta love tradition, but it's always nice to bring in something new. So the music for this is by uh, Annie Lewis and Rabbi Yosef Goldman. Eliyahu Hanavi, Eliyahu Hanavi, Eliyahu Han teach me, Eliyahu Agiladi, Eliyahu Hanavi. Oh, I forgot <laughs> to to my guitar string back up. Here we go. Eliyahu Hanavi, Eliyahu Hanavi. Awesome, awesome. I love that melody. So nice and uplifting. Um, and we normally sing Eliyahu Hanavi, uh, both on Passover when we're talking, obviously, about the prophet Elijah Eliyahu, um, but also on Havdalah as well. That's one of our closing uh, pieces to Havdalah. All right, um, one more. Josh Warshawski here. This one is called Marabu. Uh, if you are have been on the religious school at all this year or in years past, you may know this one, Marabu, how numerous uh, are your gifts, how numerous are your wonders and all your creations and all the things you do. Um, this is part of the Yotzer or uh, one of the morning prayers that we have in our morning liturgy. So Marabu, repeat after me, you can shout after me, you can dance with me, you can cook with me, whatever you guys are doing. So Marabu, here we go.
Classic, one of the first uh, Josh Ruchowski songs that I've learned. Um, and then uh, the other one, Elohai Neshama, another beautiful melody. We'll play that one next week. Um, all right, cool. Let's start to wind it down. Let's sing a little uh, Eitz Chaim by um, Joe Buchanan. And uh, he calls this song home. And it has a really nice story and kind of uh, maybe recognizes that, um, that, 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 tree of life that idea that idea that we uh we come from this divine place and that we um there's a reason why we're here and we're all connected in some way shape or form of an or another uh that um that it should feel home it should feel like home when uh, when we feel like we belong and especially in our faith and in our uh, in our community so this has a really nice story around it um, but the words are, of course, it's chayin hi lama chazikim ba betom cheha meushar.
lovely piece. Uh, yeah, another one of my favorites from Joe. He has so much good music, um, but this this uh, melody particularly hits hits home for me. So I hope you enjoyed that. All right, finally, let's close our song session today with Gesher Tsar Me'od by Rabbi Yosef Goldman, a perfect one to close with saying that the world is like a very narrow, tiny bridge and there's danger on one side, there's danger on the other side, but no matter what, no matter what we face, no matter what's around us, we should never fear. We should never live our life in fear, rather uh, know that God is around us to protect us and to connect us and um, to heal us, to uh, to help us. So, Gesher Sameod, Rabbi Yosef Goldman. <laughs> everyone had a wonderful time during our song session today it's so nice to be here with you and to share music with you and to sing with you i hope you enjoyed so thanks for being with me uh tell your friends i'll see you again next week we have so much more music to cover it's like an there's an infinite world of jewish music out there and i'm <laughs> working to learn all of it or as much of it as i can so i hope you like the new one hamera today and um i'm gonna start trying to get some jacob spike kraus thrown in there uh he was wonderful when he came through and it was such an honor to have him uh so yeah i just gotta get those chops up <laughs> all right everyone i'll see you next time bye shalom